G'day, my name's Connor Smith, and uh, today here we got an engine out of an RZ350. So what's happened to this engine is it's had the piston seized into the block, and uh, we couldn't get it out. We tried using a rubber mallet and hitting them out, and they just would not come out at all. So uh, we've gone ahead and created our own uh, little tool. And um, so we got this bit of metal here, and we've marked all the holes out with the head gasket that we pulled off and uh, I've gone and drill pressed them all and then we pulled this uh, thread off of an old puller and we've um, tapped a hole through here to put this old little screw through it to so what, well, how it's going to work is that when it goes onto the head like this you're going to put it onto the head bolts oh, wrong way and you're just gonna get your nuts screw them on to the head bolts Now what we're going to do is we're going to twist this and what's it's going to do is it's going to pull up on the bolts and then this screw is going to push down on the piston which is going to eventually push it out with a bit of ease. You might have to use a bit of a hammer hit or two to try and get it out. But it really depends on how seized it is. The other one we had to hit a few times to get out and then keep screwing it, hit it a few times, then screw. But uh, this one might be a bit easier to get out. We'll see. Seems to be screwing out pretty easy. Don't forget that's there if you want. You can see that the piston's slowly coming out through here. It was up a bit higher before. Just use the spanner to make it a bit easier. Oh, that's much better. There you go. It's much easier. Remember that when you were doing it, use a spanner or a longer device to uh, get better leverage than I was. There we go, it's coming out nicely.
And there you have it. Ooh. Nice. Too easy.